Hello friends, I hope you've enjoyed my dad's pen making and video making skills and the one he made in the video is this composite pen made with two woods with ebony and the bulk of the handle being bokote, an African wood in the middle there's a silver ring with gold leaves and on the front a removable nib which you can change and the stand is again made from Bokote as you can see it's a it's a hardwood mostly yellowish but with uh, thick black lines going through it same in the handle and at least now I don't have to explain many of the processes that uh, are needed to make such a pen my dad was uh, gracious enough to show some time from his workshop and uh, this is just one of the total of seven pens that are um, for this collection he wanted them to be named the summer collection because they are made in the summer <clears throat> not uh, not much else going on there but uh, he's making so much pens right now that it's a bit hard for us to come up with names but uh, we believe that the names are just secondary as most of these pens just speak for themselves and what tastes the person has and as you can see this one is again a mahogany style pen with uh, two medallions carved somewhat into the pen with a blunt tip and the stand, the stand is made from another African hardwood named Iroko and speaking of Iroko one of these pens is entirely made by it as you can see it's a much lighter color than mahogany it's a slightly larger pen as a whole with the uh, de decorations on the silver ring and for some of these we actually wanted to go a bit in the beginning where the first pens were really really delicate with a somewhat thicker end and these are personally my favorites because I really enjoy this kind of shape I feel it uh, most comfortable and it looks really nice and one other kind of special one is this one with its odd shape as you can see it's a bit flat in here but round on its base and this motif in the end which is actually inspired by Bulgarian shepherds from the past and I believe now as well have these uh, long sticks with this kind of shape in the end we call them Gega 
So this is a Gega in pen form. It's actually used to reel sheep or other livestock from running away. So again, a beautiful collection from my dad. I hope you liked the video and if any of these pens you find as beautiful as we do find them, please feel free to visit our website. Uh, all of these pens are available for sale. If you have any questions or need any assistance, just uh, feel free to contact me on any of the social networks or emails or whatever. So, once again, thank you for watching and your support, and I'll see you next time.